Hey, Jim White here. Welcome to my living room. Um, here, look. That's my piano I, I played when I was a kid. See that key right there? Um, when I was nine and I was going through my pyromaniac stage, uh, I set that key on fire. But uh, it seems to have survived, as, as have I. Um, so this is where I live. Um, my house is full of junk. It's just full. Uh, I got a lot of stuff. I got stories to tell, both visually and verbally. Um, as I've been uh, talking about recently on social media, I've been working on a big project. It's called Monkey Land, and I just finished it. Uh, Monkey Land is a two and a half hour spoken word piece centered around the phenomenon known as glossolalia. Uh, and so I'm done with it, and, and it's two and a half hours long. And I, I, I need to sell it because uh, that's how us starving artists stay alive is by selling the things that take us three months to make. It took me about three months to make Monkey Land. Um, so I was thinking about selling it, but it doesn't fit on, you know, like CDs. Uh, it's too big to go on, it'd be like three CDs. And if I ship three CDs to some of the faraway places where people ask for CDs, it's pretty expensive. So I was trying to think of some alternative route, you know? Like, um, uh, I thought about SoundCloud, but that seems so just impersonal, you know? Um, so finally, uh, what I did, I, I, I just bought a bunch of these things right here. Uh, these thumb drives, you know? And so I, I thought, okay, well, I'll, like I got fans in Iran and China and Australia and faraway places, which is expensive to ship things that are larger, but this should be pretty cheap to send. Um, so I was going to send Monkey Land on that and charge a nominal fee for it, you know. Um, but then I realized, well, this is a 16 gig drive, um, and Monkey Land's only about two and a half gigs. That's a lot of extra space that I'm just sending somewhere, you know, empty. So that occurred to me, well, you know, I got all this junk, you know, like I got junk everywhere. Um, also on my computer, I have junk. And I thought, well, actually, some of this junk might actually be, like, valuable to fans. Um, like, these live shows. Um, there's three or four live shows that I was real fond of, the, the, the way they turned out. That, uh, well, if you're never going to get to see me play, if you're in, in some faraway country that I never go to, this would be the next best thing. Um, there's also this, uh, last year I made this compilation disc uh, that has... Uh, it's 30 songs um, from live performances around the world. So if, you, if you're interested in what my live shows sound like, this is an opportunity to hear both uh, sequentially a, a beginning to end one and then, you know, the greatest hits, basically. Um, so that's, that's a pretty cool offer. So Monkey Land and the live shows. But then people were asking me about, you know, I, I reportedly got signed with the worst demo of any artist anywhere. And uh, this is the, the material that I sent to uh, David Byrne long, long, long ago. Uh, there's Word Mule, which appeared in Breaking Bad. This is a demo for Word Mule. Heaven of My Heart, which appeared in uh, a movie called Home Fries with Drew Barrymore. Um, there's all kinds of songs. Some you've heard, uh, some, some you haven't. Uh, this one I wrote for Sade um, long before I became a quote-unquote recording artist. There's personal stuff, which, like, if you're a stalker or something, this will suit you just fine. Um, like, here's here's a, a modeling picture. That's my headshot when I was a model. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and there I am in, in London with some disinterested woman. Um, there's surfing pictures. Uh, there's all kinds of things. Each folder has its own little synopsis to let you know what you're looking at. Like, these are uh, art pieces that I've made over the years. All kinds of interesting... Uh, Assemblages, which is what I do sort of in my spare time. Some gallery shows, um, photos, like I was a fine art photographer for many years, so there's uh, a lot of interesting photos you know, uh, taken, taken long ago. Art museum exhibits, there's just all kinds of stuff in here. So what I figured was, oh look, videos. There's a film that I made uh, at NYU when I was there, um, hour-long film. There's, uh, oh, there's this film I made in Denmark. They hired me to, to make a, a shoot and write, shoot, and direct a, a film in Denmark with one of Denmark's leading actors, Tommy Kettner, or Kentner. Um, 
there's a bunch of unreleased songs um, or variations of songs that you know, like Static on the Radio. This is a version of Static on the Radio that uh, it's like an alternative version. I wrote a, a, a second version of it to see if the la label liked that better, um, but they didn't. Um, so there's 20 short stories that I've written. So it's kind of like getting a book of short stories. Um, so as you can see, it's 15 gigs, 16 gigs almost of Jim White. Um, and, you know, I, I, in this day and age when it's so hard to figure out uh, a new product to get people everywhere I go, I listen and hear amazing artists playing. Um, I figure, well, if I can't give them quality, I'll give them quantity. <laughs> It's like one of those Ronco ads, you know, like, but wait, there's more. There's art. There's ephemera. There's friends. There's live shows. There's monkey land. Um, so that's the deal. Um, I'm, that's my next uh, commercial uh, commodity that I'm going to try to sell. And, and I do that uh, not uh, out of some cynical impulse. That's how I feed uh, my daughter. That's her there. Um, uh, and, and pay the mortgage and, and keep myself uh, out of the poorhouse. Uh, it's getting increasingly difficult to do that with with all the streaming platforms that do not pay artists. So this is a way for you to support artists directly. Um, your chance to do that comes right now. If you're interested in getting the thumb drive, you can send to PayPal. You can send $35 to this address, jimsuperwhite43 at gmail.com. And... Uh, I will ship this thing off to you as soon as possible. It can go anywhere in the world for a, a cheap price. So that's a flat rate all around the world, 35. Um, and that's it. Um, I'm done with my presentation. I hope that you buy it, not only because, uh, you know, I could use uh, the income, but also because I think you'll enjoy it. Um, we'll see you around the neighborhood. Uh, I'll be touring uh, over in Belgium in the summer uh, and have a new record out. Uh, oh, probably about this time next year. Um, side project under the band name Grandpa Drummer. Okay, until next time. So long.